A Rappler exclusive. Armor vests intended for troops deployed to last year's Zamboanga siege are still sitting in a warehouse inside Camp Aguinaldo because of defects. Rappler learned the Defense Department tried to rush the delivery of the armor vests from Serbian company UM Mercata at the height of the siege in September 2013. The Serbian company was awarded the contract to deliver 3,480 units of armor vests worth 120 million pesos or about $2.7 million. But the vests never reached the soldiers, forcing the army to make an emergency purchase of about 1,000 vests for an additional 28.3 million pesos or about $630,000. The supplier of the emergency purchase, Stone of David Tactical Equipment Company, is linked to the company which failed to deliver UM Mercata. Its local representative, Christopher Manalus, is the general manager of Stone of David. The Serbian company eventually delivered the body armors in January 2014, but tests showed the vests were defective. Rappler also obtained documents about the controversial bidding processes for the military's armor vests. In 2013, UM Mercata was also set to win the bidding for 44,000 units of armor vests worth 1.76 billion pesos or about 40 million U.S. dollars following the disqualification of the lowest bidder, Colon Global of South Korea. But the Serbian company's ability to secure deals changed in 2014 when the leadership in the Defense Department's Bid and Awards Committee also changed.